Hi everyone, sorry I haven't made any videos recently. I've had some major deadlines. Um, check out uh, Political Powers Donald Trump 2 by Tidal Wave Comic Books. That should be coming out this month uh, and it features my artwork. Anyhow, uh, next strip I'm working on is a Transformers Armada strip. So I just thought I'd show you what I do with that. Okay, so if, as soon as I receive the script, um, I looked at what characters were in it, and I did some research, and looked at some toys, and looked online at those pieces, and then I just banged up just some rough sketches of those characters in dynamic poses like this. Then as I got to the script, I do these really cheesy thumbnails of just every page, and it's not even laid out properly there, and it's most of those little scribbles probably mean nothing to anybody except me, but I use those as reference points, and then I go ahead and sketch sketch them out in large pages. Now looking at sort of the page composition of what I want, okay. And then what I'll do from within that is I'll then uh, scan it into my computer, and then uh, so I can play around with it, mess around with it, maybe increase the size of things or shrink uh, elements and tidy it up a little bit. And then I'll print it out, and. Uh, uh, this this now is my light box. This is a new one that I've got. If you've seen the old videos, you might recognise I had a, a rather large one. This is the Mini Sun light pad, and it's it's nice and portable. I took it to my last convention, and what I'll use it for, as you can see, is I can now just trace those really nasty sketches um, directly onto my comic book page, and hopefully, once it's finished, it should look something like this. So that's a quick insight into how I work drawing comic books. I hope that's uh, helped you and given you some insight and inspired you to go out and draw comics. See you later.